Good morning guys and welcome back to another day of Vlogmas. This morning I am out and about really early because I am off to meet up with a friend who has recently had a baby. Um, she's had a little girl named Sunday and she looks adorable. I'm so excited to see her. So you may also recognize her because her name is Fern McCann and she was in Towie. I'm a celebrity. She's a presenter on this morning. You know, she's a bit of a celeb now um, but she actually used to be my hairdresser like back in the day. She's a bit busy for that right now. Um, but yes, let's go and see how she's doing. I'm just going to her flat right now. <gasps> Hello. Hi. Oh my God, she's perfect. She's cute. She's she opened her eyes. Oh, I know. Oh. That is so cute. Making me broody. <laughs> I mean, I, I'm thinking like, where are we? He's going to have to. I'm here at Fern's flat with the most perfect looking baby I've ever seen. <gasps> she is adorable. Look at her little face. She's uh, rather cute. And I was just saying to Fern when I got here, um, so a very, very long time ago, Fern used to do my hair. <laughs> I did. She is like, well, you are a trained hairdresser like Vidal Sassoon, aren't you? you I like... trained and worked for Sassoon's as a colorist and I used to do yeah. You do your hair. Yeah, and it was when I was having my hair done once and I was talking to Fern about YouTube because you had a channel. Yeah, the time. Oh, did I, yeah, I posted like three videos. <laughs> but she was doing like some beauty. Well, we were just talking about YouTube, weren't we? And I was like, I reckon I could do that. I could do like a mummy channel. And you were like, you I do it. I remember the conversation so vividly oh. and now you're like, so successful. No. It's like, no, you are. It's like oh, you're smashing it so. with the mummy videos. Yeah. And I think that's so cool because I was doing your hair. Yeah, yeah. And you was working. Yeah, you were like, you should do it. I was like, oh, you know, because you feel like nervous at the beginning. I you know. were like, I like to do it. Now look at her, she's well, smashing her. it. Yeah. And now you're a mum. Yay. And I want to show you the tree as well. Just over here. Look at how beautiful that is. Look, I mean, you've got to have I've got to get this bauble in. And a little bit of bling at Christmas. Look at how nice that is. Yeah. We love it. How are all the early days going so far? I mean, you look all, you, she honestly looks like she's got it really all like together. Like everything looks clean and nice and. I mean, you look I've happy. Got, I've got a cleaner. Yeah. I've got a cleaner. I can't take credit for There's this. There's a very... mum hack for you. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I can't take credit for this very clean flat. Um, and my mum is like my full time doula. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> I swear to God, like, she's. Your she's been amazing, amazing. yeah. Amazing. And she, it's going to be very difficult moving back to the flat because my mum, and I'm so grateful to her because she's been doing all the behind the scenes work, which mm. I know a lot of mums out there, you know, they have to do that themselves, like the cooking, cleaning, looking after other children mm. and oh, changing your sheets mom, and you know, it's everything nice like to that. Have absolutely pair of hands yeah right? exactly so she does all the behind the scenes work which has allowed me to solely concentrate on sunday <laughs> she done a pee <laughs> just done an explosion sunday that's what you need that's like she was i know oh, let God, me see sir. I mean, if it hasn't leaked no we'll, she's we'll all break. in white but there's no uh... oh my god he can smell a little bit <laughs> Smiles are going to happen any time now. Oh no, it's she's great. got dimples. Yeah, she has, which I don't think I've got dimples. She's so cute. She's really cute. So that you, you really question yourself when you're when you're a first time mum about like, if other mums are around, I'm like, oh, don't judge me. No, it's so funny. Like, I think I parent differently in front of other people. That's so true. Yeah, like if you're at a play group, you're like, I should really turn him off because everyone's looking. Mm, that's it. <laughs> Whereas sometimes at home you're like, I just need the easy life. I went to um, a baby massage class the other day and opened my changing bag and had um, wipes that probably weren't the wipes that people think that you should use. And I was like <laughs> hiding them, not oh, getting like them out of the packet. Yeah, I was nervous <gasps> about getting these. It? Like, so silly, isn't it's it? It's so silly. Right, so I've just left Fern's place and it was so nice to catch up with her. You may have seen I had a cuddle with Sunday as well and I wasn't going to because I've had a cold, but Fern was like, honestly, she has a cold as well, just hold her, it's fine. So I held her and I tried like not to breathe in her direction, but she is just the most beautiful baby. She is so perfect. She looks like a little doll. Like she's such a cute baby, so, so cute. Um, but yeah, Fern seemed like she was doing really well. She seemed like she was a very natural mum and 
yeah, she's doing it all on her own. So she's doing an amazing job. And what I would really love for you to do, if you're in the UK, please tune in on Tuesday night, this Tuesday coming, um, to see Fern's TV show. She's done a one-off show called First Time Mum. And it's basically her journey of pregnancy, birth, and being a new mum. So I'd love for you guys to tune in and support her. I am sure it's going to be amazing because she is very like an open person and she even vlogged parts of the birth and I know it will be a really good watch. So definitely tune in to see that on ITVB Tuesday night at 9pm. Um, so yeah, I'm really looking forward to that. But yeah, I've just made it home now. Right, I'm home to this little guy now and he is not feeling very well, are you? Not 100%. Um, but I also forgot to say that while I was with Fern we filmed a full interview for Channel Mum so I will link their channel down below if you want to go and check out the full interview it will be out in about three days it'll be out on Tuesday so go and check that out um, but now I'm gonna go see what the big boys are up to and we are just writing some Christmas cards aren't we so Fraser you're writing them all to your friends and Caleb, you're writing them all to your friends and grandparents, yeah? And Caleb can write his name now. Look at this. <gasps> C-A-L-E-B. I'm just going to do the N now. Okay. Oh, yeah, that wasn't long. Oh, man. Is that a... What is that? Uh -uh. That's, is that an air? Uh? No, it's an air. An air. Wow. Oh, so close. So that air needs to go after the l, doesn't it? Uh, it's okay. It's Don't. Oh, <laughs> that looks really good. So these are the Christmas cards that the boys designed themselves. This snowman over here is Caleb's, and then the tree is Fraser's one. I just think they're so good. I can't believe that they did them all themselves. They're excellent boys. Right, we're now just making some festive snacks. Caleb is here just cutting the banana and grapes up. He's doing a very good job. We're basically uh -oh. making these. So you can hear Jackson. I'm holding him. So we're making these little like snowmen lolly like stick things. So you basically just take your fruit and put it like that to make a little snowman. And also these little Santa hats, how cute are they? So they're just strawberries dipped in yogurt and also with like desiccated coconut on it as well. Yes, yeah, so I'm basically making an Instagram post for Ella's Kitchen and these are their recipes. Mommy. I'll link the recipes down below if you want to go and check them out. But they've got four really cute little recipes. So I thought we'll all get in our festive jumpers and have a little photo. Okay. Yeah. I love yours. Caleb's is really cool because whenever he moves, what happens? It lights up. Do a little shake. Let's see. Will it light up? Oh, I can see it. So I've got my festive jumper on now. I think I've shown this one before, but it's a Santa Define Good. I got it from Next. And Jackson's got a little number on it that says ho, ho, ho on it. Matching leggings. Hey, we're all festive now. What have you got? I can show them your outfit now. Way looking smart. Right, so my friend Jane just came around for a little bit and the whole time she was here, Jackson was so clingy to me, like he literally wouldn't be put down for anything. And now that she's left, yeah, now that she's left, he is like fine again. <sighs> so it's obviously, I think he just thought she was maybe gonna take him because she has like had him for a bit before this clingy bit is like it's really hard but it's also nice to be like wanted and needed um, and i know that one day i'm gonna really miss it when he doesn't really like want me at all but um some days it's relentless like, when you can't even go to the loo or get dressed in the morning or the boys are killing each other <laughs> <laughs> right, I've got this monstrous thing back out of the garage. This is what Caleb used to stand in while I was cooking and stuff. Because he always wanted to be involved, but I need both hands. So, Jackson's the exact same. Whenever I'm cooking, he's like, please hold me. Um, but now, he can stand next to me and hopefully, he's quite safe in this. Like, you can't really fall out. So, yes, Matt hates this thing. He thinks it looks really ugly in our kitchen. But it's super safe, isn't it? You holding a knife isn't very safe, though. Should we make some sandwiches? Right, you ready? Yeah. Some butter. You do it. That's it. 
What are you doing? <laughs> He's gonna dance, aren't you? Okay, let me hold that then. It's a bit dangerous, Baba. The boys and I are just playing a game where you get a Christmas stocking, one of you goes to sleep, and then the other one is Santa, fills it up with toys, and then like gives you the stocking. You have to like go through the contents. They love playing this game, don't you? Even you, Fraser. But at the moment, Fraser is obsessed with his brand new Nintendo Switch. He got it for his birthday. Mommy, I'm to go to bed. And he loves it. Mommy, I'm to go to sleep. Okay. Don't okay. Don't say what it is. Okay. I can't know what's inside, Mummy. Okay. I'm asleep. Now wake up. <gasps> I'll show you. I have snacks and toys. Oh my gosh, it's Santa. I have snacks and toys for you. Do you? What, what kind? Oh my god. Oh yeah. my goodness. I got a nature body bar and yoga and toys. Oh, some Ella's Kitchen. is <gasps> Some nature valley bars. Yes. It's just full of food. Ah, look. Oh, wow. This is what I wanted. Fidget spinner. I give you that. And I a got... match attacks tin. And I got you two fidget. Right, she's asleep. Okay, you can wake up now. Wake up. Good morning. <gasps> What Santa's been? Can you believe it? Whoa! I know. What did Santa get in my sock stocking? What did he get? Oh, look! Right, I am now hiding in my bedroom because Matt's mum has come round to have the boys for a few hours for me so I can just do a little bit of work um, and like editing for the vlog and stuff. So I'm hiding in my bedroom because even if I'm in the next room, Jackson seems to know about it and he will be at the door, like, trying to get to me. Um, so yeah, I'm hiding in my room basically with my laptop and I'm just going to do a little bit of work. <laughs> I'm still hiding out in my room. I've been here for about two hours and I have got loads done. But I think I'm gonna end the vlog here because it's probably quite long by now. So thank you so much for watching. I'll be back tomorrow and I'll see you then. Bye guys.